People are really paying more attention to the memes you're you're watching on Reddit than the actual set. How does that feel? <laughs> Dude, that that's like the actually the oldest repost in the IRL. I've never seen that. I've seen it at least five or six times. You're the, you're the reason that like bad things happen in the world, Bandit. Dude, I'm sorry I don't like recommend people. People like you. Dude, when I found me RL, I literally will just go on top of all time and like for like the next two hours I'll be entertained. It's amazing. No, 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 no. Top of like me IRL. No, top, top of Reddit sucks, dude. Top of Reddit is just like people with cancer. And Obama. Oh, that's true, yeah. Okay, some of them are really bad. But some of them are amazing. Yeah. So what's happening? Oh. It's just the, the, the coast word thing. Dude, how many times? Four coast words? <laughs> what? Okay. TM just missed the, the warlock punch on a sleeping puff. Ah. Oh, and then crit misses the rest though, so it's all good. I, I would have died, yeah. No, TM's like shaking his head too. He's like, he almost had, he knew it almost happened. Wait, if you watch WT Fox, the set where um, HBox lost to, I think it was M2K, there was one point where he hit a phantom rest, and I'd never seen him, someone until this in my life. It was the funniest thing. I was actually dying. Alright. Grip has good edgeguards on Ganon. He knows how to do it. Yeah, I would actually be unsurprised if Crip. You know, won this set. Mingi actually be upset TM and winners already. You know, it, yeah. Dude, Coast Word's definitely a dank memer. So. You minimize comments? You're one of those people? You're one of those people? You just but you don't look at the post that often, do you? You I see it once. References like look at that guy in the background. Now I don't have to scroll all the way back up. That's why you open it in two tabs, dude. Get get with the the modern day. You you need you need to improve your meme browsing significantly. Alright. I'm kinda surprised that TM went straight back to this stage. I feel like like why not Yoshi's? Like, a, a smaller stage with more platforms would definitely give him more room to, like... You just be able to control the stage better. Telemars? Yeah, I, I feel that way, actually. I don't know what you're referring to, Will, because it's like a, a minute delay. But I'm going to say, yeah. Yeah, you suck, Bandit. If that's what Will was referring to. This is like losers' quarters, right? Or no, because TM lost earlier than that. This is like losers. This might be for top eight, actually. Which is weird to think TM, you know, might not make a top eight, but it's actually looking that way. Crip defending his HM status so far. Is this like what does loser get? Loser gets ninth, right? Yeah, loser gets ninth. Please. I'm really talking about how to browse memes, so. How to browse memes? <laughs> Dude, meme browsing is a pretty interesting topic, let me tell you, though. Is that Will SSBM? Yeah. Re famous retired player? Retired. Did yeah. you, yo, fun fact, did you know that he's actually the brother of Nexic? The brother of Nexic? The, fam the famous Falco from Rochester? I, no actually don't, I actually don't think they're brothers. I think Nexic is a Reed's brother. And that yeah, I think so too. The second Portnoy brother is actually Russell. Yeah, that's, that, that makes sense to me because I see Russell and Will together way more. You know yeah. what I mean? 
Uh, so if if you know, Will does his weekly Nexic fact. Oh yeah. I I want I really want to submit my own. Just talk to my own like like really obvious ones. Like Nexic's real name is Mark, and he's actually brother. His his last name is Portnoy because he's a brother to Will Portnoy. Oh shit. The famous retired Smash player. His last name is actually Reitz though because he's about part of the Reitz. Uh, qu- was it quintet now? Qu- was Wait, what did, a, qu- you, did you beat Mark? Uh yeah. Okay. That there's your update, Will. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Updates next. Uh, he he wrecked me game one. I was playing awful, and then he was playing so bad game three. I felt really bad. But uh, yeah. It's the mid level. I'm gonna win tilt. Yeah, yeah. It always happens. Oh, he, that's what he said too. He was like, oh, I swear I can actually do this, and he then, then all of a sudden he couldn't even play a video game. No, anymore. you're talking about that. Yeah, this, the second you realize I can do this, you stop thinking about the game and start thinking about like whether or not you're gonna lo- win or lose, right. and you just become like bad. You're like, yeah, it's gonna be so cool. I tell my friends about this this game that I just played, uh, and that, uh, maybe, and I don't know. That's probably going through Crip's head, actually, though, because he just took that set. Don't so. scar our secrets, fam. Yeah, yeah. might be will. Might be. I'm, I'm just like blowing up in the whole like Portnoy scandal. For sure. Th- there's gonna be like a, a book one day about the Portnoy lineage. So that was for ninth. So who, who's seventh now? So this is. You mean twenty five? I got. Do you, do you have it already? I do not. I was gonna browse memes, but I guess you, you I can you can browse memes. I can pull it up. Sick. With my sick phone that I now have. So that's a cellular communication. All right. Uh, I wish it just came up when I like asked it to come up. Uh, I hate when the brackets are hosted by Magic Cube, so I can't like look up Mingy's challenge. They're hosted by Magic Cube. No, 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 no. Uh, I know where they are. There's the some of, some of the early ones are so I, I usually I'll, like if I can't find oh, it yeah. I'll go to the user kind of deal. But this one's definitely a Mingy one. I just go to the most recent you mean I have typed it in my like search history. All right. I, then I go to the user and do that. I got you. It usually works. I feel you. I feel you. I'm feeling the meta right now. Maybe this is just it. No, it's not just it. It's not just challenge.com slash you mean twenty five. Br be get right next fact. Wall. Get right. Get right. Write a next fact. I All don't right. see it on Mingy's thing. I have, a, yeah, I have a UM25. Uh, maybe it's, maybe it is under Heartstrings. Maybe under Zach. Oh, does Joe have a challenge? I don't know, but he's one. He's one who makes the bracket now, so. I see. Makes sense. Oh yeah. Uh, Uming25. It is Uming25. Challenge.com slash Uming25. It's not, it's, but it's not that, yeah. Wait, the bracket's right there. I'm dumb. Michigan Smash Challenge.com. Oh my god. Is that oh is ac- god. actually that important? So it's okay, so it's Rab's challenge. Why well, add more stuff at type in, dude? I don't know. Yeah. Alrighty. Slash you meme twenty five. Alright, we got this. Alright. Actually we have Omar Morse playing. Yeah, they're playing off stream, aren't they? We're I'm looking for Omar's like silly little hat. No, there it is. Yo, Omar. Omar. Omar, uh, I'm raging. I'll get him. You, you have to say you have to say you say hard strings. He 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 hears he hears hard strings and like knows people are talking about him and like flocks to you. It's it's like Voldemort. Hard strings is like Voldemort. If you say it, he'll know. <laughs> All right, guys. So we have Morse, Omar, which is probably gonna happen soon on stream. And then Lane Sheep, I assume, is happening right now. Wait, so is Omar playing on stream? Omar's response was very quick. It was just nah, and then he went back to his conversation. So don't take that from Omar. Don't don't let Omar think he's a top player. Don't let Omar think he's a top player. He's That's doing. Like he, he, he definitely just gave me that Prince of Boo. I can. S- do, okay, so Omar is yes. actually the Prince of Boo. My favorite quote from Duck was that I think it was at Change of Heart when Duck said like he's like Omar hung out with all the top players and like started copying us. Okay. But if all the people could have copied, he could copy me. Could copy Cody, could copy Kalamazoo even. Yeah. So he chose to copy Prince of Boo. <laughs> what is wrong with him? Dude, Prince is actually funny though. Uh, we, d- we definitely take Prince it. Prince is in chat probably. Yeah. He was so earlier. So Crips, Crips Bracket's looking a lot less hard now that he's taken out TM. I'm looking at it now. He's got Lane or Sheep and then Anther. Those are all the people he's like beaten before. So My favorite Abu meme is when I play Overwatch with him and people like recognize him. Oh, yeah. I always just start spamming follow me at the Friends of SSBM. In at Friends of SSBM. Yep. I believe it's spamming like a thousand. We just like all start spamming that. Yo. Well, the, it's really funny. I've been playing with Rob before because his tag is Jungle Guy and people like recognize like, are you Jungle Guy the Smash, T.O.? Oh, right. And then I start talking to them about Smash. I have You're a clip <laughs> saved of me freaking out because I thought it was so funny. Yeah, it's really funny. Yeah, that's great. I love I love the comedy. I think it's just because like like Overwatch was so hyped up in the Smash community, actually, like beforehand. You know I'm what I mean? Everyone stops playing it now. Yeah, 
I mean, I haven't even I haven't got into it yet. I need a computer that could run that shit. Playing it in a six man is like the best online experience you can have in a video game. Yeah, I mean, sixes in TF2 was like that too. Sixes in TF2 was so fun; it's just impossible to set up. Like we used to have thirty twos in Battlefield. Oh yeah. Oof. But that Ooh. was because I used it's to like a raid, dude. That's sick. No, I, I used to moderate a Reddit, um, like a subreddit. Yeah. That was basically like all dedicated to like a couple servers that we controlled for Battlefield. Oh sweet. So we would literally just like it came because you used a thing called Team Awesome, which is like, it was a raid group basically. Yeah. Where like, because back then there was no, you couldn't like own a server. You had to just like use their servers. Right. So what we would do is we'd all organize like, all right, everyone at seven o'clock, join this random empty server. Yeah. And hope that no ran like randoms get in before we, we all get in. Oh right, that makes sense. And then they you started being able to buy your own servers. So someone from that group bought their own server and started running it. And That's then I, sweet. I played that. I actually played like, Battlefield comp competitively for a while. Yeah. And then the game like died. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> I remember the, the crash of Battlefield. Because it was so big for a second, though. It was like, well, like popular at least, not like in terms of esports, well, but like popular. Well, esports, they they kind of promised like a million dollar tournament for Xbox. Yeah, I remember that. There's something I remember. And I was thing like, yo, I'm legit only a top ten team in Xbox. Let's go. And Let's then they're like, yeah, never mind. And I'm like, I quit the game. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> I like the day I got kids, I quit, I quit the game. I was like, this game sucks. I'm done. <laughs> I love it. I can't deal with this stupid. <laughs> it's just, well, uh, you mean, you, I mean, that's like. That's like, that's that's not the classic like Microsoft thing though, promising something like super big and then be like, oh yeah, just kidding, we're actually not doing the big thing. I we mean, just it was it was do. like mostly EA, I think. Yeah, that also sounds right <laughs> though in terms of like gaming companies. EA continually overpromises on their like desire to invest in the esports scene because they yeah. think that they can like start taking. They they thought they could challenge Call of Duty's place in the esports scene. Oh yeah. And then they realized they couldn't, and so they just gave up. <laughs> The classic dude, and then oh, uh, did you see the thing about Star Wars Battlefront where like they released the game incomplete and then they sold the shit that finished the game for like sixty extra dollars? Yeah, but, <laughs> like that's why I don't buy. <laughs> Overwatch is actually the first like game I bought on release in at least like three years. Right. I mean, it's, I mean, it hasn't changed. Like, you still can buy the incomplete game for sixty dollars, and then buy the extra DLC for another sixty dollars, which makes the game good. Like I, I miss the days when all you needed was a GameCube and Melee. <laughs> yeah, the days are the days are uh, the days are still young, dude. They're still here, man. Yeah. yeah. I I look forward to ten years from now. When it's still the exact same, except we have less CRTs. Yeah. What, once we start getting our lagless monitors or whatever is like, gonna actually end up happening? Are we actually ever gonna get a match? Oh, we got Crip Anther. Okay, sweet. I'll take that. Yeah, oh. Anther got upset by Yo-Yo, which is, like, not <laughs> that much of an upset. Yeah. Well, so for the past, like, six weeks, Anther was consistently Anther, beating, beating yo -Yo. him, yeah. And then Yo-Yo beat him today. I feel like Yo-Yo had the majority before, though, like, for a long time. They were back and forth for a very long time. Yo-Yo had, like, a, a month-long period of winning, like, a bunch of money matches and, like, one or two tournament sets. Okay. And then Anther, like, figured it out, kind of. Makes and sense. then I guess yeah, you beat him today for the first time in like a month and a half, so that's cool. Right. I know for a fact this has happened in Crips' favor before. Uh, is, uh, oh, this is an Anther. Oh, I just saw Anther there. Anther's playing friendly. Looks the, the set next to him. It's looking like Lane. I don't know. Right? Maybe they're just they're just maybe they're just having a debate to decide the outcome of their set. Lane's just a the, verbal Lane, debate. Lane's the kind of guy who. You, He'll play a tournament set with you, and then he'll play like three friendlies with you, even though he's another game to play. Yeah. What's up? Okay, yeah. I think Omar used to say that we needed three TOs here. One to, like, set everything up, one to run bracket, and one to follow around lane and DQ him. <laughs> Dude, it's true, though. The lane's stupid rule, the fact that it exists, is very, very justified. What's lane's stupid rule? Where you, where, just where you can't enter multiple games. It's just like the limit, ca capping how many games you can cross enter. Because he was a brawl player, he plays PM. Melee. Uh, that's it. I don't think he plays. He explore. holds up brackets when he's only in one of them. I know. So, so like, can you imagine the you know, imagine cross entry lane, dude. D try not to imagine cross entry lane. Try not to think about cross entry lane. So, uh, lane. Yeah, how would he have like? He can't even get enough like money to pay for like this bracket. How I know. Is he doing like four brackets. I don't know. No, I think uh, uh I don't know. Lane's a strange guy. I I don't think I don't think it's cool to look at his think about his past though because like coming from like you know being like.